Hey guys, welcome to video one of the Bulletproof Back program. Now, well done on grabbing this. A lot of guys don't even go as far as grabbing a health self-help video series like this. So good on you for that. Over the next seven days, we're gonna dive into all the key principles that I've learned over the years of myself having back pain and over the last eight years of helping thousands of other guys all around the world. A lot of people will sit back, suffer in silence, and never take that first step to begin to help themselves. It's the whole awareness and the knowledge and the pain points and postures that we get ourselves in that keep people stuck in these positions. So I'm looking forward over the next seven days to share all these important tips with you so you can start to troubleshoot it and beat your back pain. Now, you've got an open mind. You're not sitting back suffering in silence like I once did as well. I used to be a carpenter. I was battling with chronic back pain. Some days were even a struggle for me to get out of bed. I had an ongoing aches and niggles in my lower back. I felt like I'd literally tried it all. I was rolling up a tarpaulin one morning and I felt a little pinch and grab in my lower back. Another time was in the surf, it flared up again. Another time when I was down at Perisher on my snowboard, the same thing, something so small you wouldn't think could cause so much of an issue. These constant flare ups were haunting me. The chronic back pain was hanging around and I literally felt like I'd started to try it all. I was going to chiropractors, I've been to physios, I was getting massage, but it still seemed to haunt me, come back, and I was spinning at my wheels trying to figure it all out, what to do next. I started to think and realize, hey, I'm just going for these treatments once a week, but what about the other 167 hours of the week? These poor positions, these awkward positions I'm getting myself in at work, the way I'm sitting, the way I'm standing, the way I'm approaching my day, my sports, when I'm in the gym. So there's so many factors that keep people in the pain cycle. These are all the little bits and pieces that we need to become very aware of and start to do things differently and move better and get our body stronger, get our core stronger and build that self-belief that we can overcome this. That it's not a life sentence, that we can beat this for good. I began to spin my wheels and search and wonder why I couldn't get a breakthrough or couldn't catch a break of, of why this wasn't getting any better. And I just sort of set back and started to accept it, unfortunately. So looking back at it now, I understand that, you know, there probably would have been a whole lot more that I could have done early on if I knew, but I just didn't have the knowledge. The accountability side of it was huge as well. Once I started to figure it out, I realized I needed a support network, I needed people to help me, I needed to start to reframe and approach things differently. Now, it was shortly after I had my back pain and a mate of mine also was suffering with some back pain and I just caught on and I started realizing the language he was using and the belief that he had. He used to say things such as, I had back pain or when I had my back pain, and I was saying things like, I have a bad back, my back was stuffed. I was using all of this language that was really holding me back and I didn't really realize it at the time. I'd get my physio exercises, um, I'd do a little bit here and there, but then I'd drop off. And it's because of this belief and this approach, the way I was approaching the situation, I didn't believe that I could actually fix myself. I didn't believe that I could actually move beyond and move past this. So then I made a decision that I was gonna do this properly, I was gonna work hard, I was gonna learn, I was gonna get the knowledge and I was gonna do things the right way. Now fast forward to where we are today and like I said, I've been helping thousands of guys around Australia and the world. I'm doing all sorts of crazy fun endurance events around Australia, all pain free. No one's actually gonna come and save you. You gotta find that, you gotta dig deep and get that accountability to start to help yourself and not always relying on others. The treatments, the passive treatments, the hands-on treatments all have a time and a place, of course, but we need to take it upon ourselves to take action and actually be hungry to get the results that we're looking for. It made such a difference in my life and I wanna share all my findings now with other people too so they too can make the transformation and get those results and kick the back pain for good. Now I play and run and have fun with my two kids and do all these crazy events all around Australia. So over the next six days, I'm gonna to bring to you 
the next principles of what you need to start to make some significant differences in your body in just a matter of days. So if you don't wanna wait for the rest of the videos and you wanna take action now and start feeling the difference in your back pain, then you can book a free call below with my team. So just click the big button, book in your call and have a chat to the guys to see how we can help you next.